Hey everybody! Hey everybody! It's Marriage Monday with, with the, the Mitchells. Mitchells. We're the Mitchells. Yes. Hope you guys are off to a great week. Anything you want to say, babe? Guess what? I'm gonna get it right today. We asked and you answered. So <laughs> here's the answer to the most popular question from yesterday. Yes. And that was question B: mm -hmm. Recovery after huge, huge disagreement. disagreement. Okay. Yep. First off, everybody has them. Yes. Everybody has a a point in their marriage where they're like. I don't think I want to be married to you anymore. I don't know if we can really recover from this. Okay, everybody has it. And you can recover. Yes, you can so we're going to tell you how we recover. We're not saying this is the way for mm -hmm. every single couple. Mm -mm. This is just how we recover. Right. Amen. All right. <laughs> hey, be honest. You got to be honest. Yes, be honest about whatever happened and why it happened. What were your feelings? Why did you say that? What made you say that? Did you really mean that? Oh. Like, let's get to the bottom of, of this. Let's get to the core right. of it so we can move forward. Why did you do that? Mm -hmm. Why did you, whatever it is, mm -hmm. you have to be honest about yes. it so that you guys can work through it mm -hmm. and move, hopefully move on yeah. away from it. Mm -hmm. um, and this doesn't happen, you know, easily. It's not. Like, honesty is not yeah. easy, mm -hmm. especially when you know it's going to hurt that person. But guess what? Yeah. You got to be honest. You got to say, hey, this yeah. is what I did. This is why I did it. Um, even if the reason sucks. Yeah, and you have to unpack that stuff. You gotta unpack. You want to grow and develop and be able to really evolve together. You gotta unpack that stuff. You gotta unpack all that junk and all that stuff. Yes. You gotta be honest about even the things that you say during the argument. Yeah. Because, woo -woo. because you can have some huge disagreements that you can't recover from. Mm -hmm. and so if you really want it to work, unpack. You gotta be unpack honest. that stuff. You gotta be honest yes. with it. Girl. Woo. <laughs> Woo. B, forgive and forget. Wait, come again. Forgive and forget. <laughs> so you got to forgive the person. Yeah. If you plan on moving forward from mm -hmm. the disagreement, you got to forgive them. And guess what? You need to forgive them quickly. I didn't say get over it quickly, but you yeah. need to forgive them quickly mm -hmm. because, you know, forgiveness is how you allow God to actually come in and heal you. I mean, what's a successful marriage without... God. What's a successful marriage without God? Come but you got to forgive them. That's right. And then you got to forget. Mm -hmm. What do we mean by forget? See, God throws his stuff into the sea of what? Forgetfulness. Forgetfulness. Yeah. And guess what? We need to do the same thing as mm -hmm. it relates to our hurts. Yeah. Not necessarily forget what happened. Right. Because guess what? You got to remember what happened so you won't go back there. Mm -hmm. But guess what? You got to forget the hurt that it caused. Right. You so your, have to every forget. response won't be that hurt. Right. And it becomes your identity within your marriage. Right. Like, no. That hurt. Like mm -hmm. you, your marriage is built on what happened. <laughs> or the 10, years ago. Ten, year, 10 years ago, you did this. And 10 right. years ago, you did. Mm -hmm. Do you know I'm not that person again from 10 years ago? So right. guess what? You got to forgive and you got to forget that hurt that yeah. whatever that huge disagreement caused you. And if you're struggling with that word, forget. How about let it go? Let it go. Let it go. That's what they said on Frozen. <laughs> let it go, let, let it go. Let it go. Let it. You mean sing it? No. Okay, anyway. C. <laughs> C. Make a consistent change. Make a consistent change. Yeah. You can't be a habitual anything. Oh. Yep, I said it. You can't be a habitual anything and mm -hmm. expect somebody to recover from it. <laughs> like, I, I can't be a constant liar and mm -hmm. expect her to start believing and trusting mm -hmm. me. Amen. You can't, if somebody in their marriage, you can't be a constant cheater. Yeah. And, you know, every time I cheat, it won't happen again. Right. You keep doing the same thing. So, guess what? Whenever, whatever that issue is, guess mm -hmm. what? I got to make a consistent change. I can't yeah. do that anymore. Mm -hmm. I can't curse Trinity out no more and yeah. expect her to want to talk to me. Or she can't curse me out. Right. Or whatever it might be. You yeah. know, we don't cuss. Mm -mm. We don't do no stuff like that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That miss? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Who would do some miss like that? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> But listen, make a consistent change. Whatever that change is, you got to sit down. You're honest. You decide you're going to forgive. And you decide you're going to let it go. You're going to forget. So every time you guys have a disagreement in the future, you want to be rechanneling what just happened right. weeks, then months, then years ago. Mm -hmm. You have got to be consistent about the changes you you guys decide to make as a couple. Yes. You got to be consistent about it. If I ask Brady to forgive me, then I need to make be really intentional about the change that I want him to see. Okay, not only for myself, but for us as a unit. Absolutely, mm -hmm. and that's how we get through some of our huge disagreements, and they happen. I'm saying yeah. they're two different people. Me and Trinity are 
a lot alike, and then at the same time, we're like a whole. We're like lot differently different. compatible. Yeah, like a whole lot different. So yeah. of course we have disagreements, especially she's a strong woman. She got seven brothers, y'all, but that's a whole nother story. <laughs> But anyway, uh, but um, yeah, that's how we get through our huge disagreements. Mm -hmm. and let me tell y'all something too. We might come back. No, we just gonna do it next week. Okay. Like, see about these cell phones. It was close. <laughs> it was close. So we'll talk about that probably next week. The, yeah. Uh, cell phones. Mm -hmm. We'll see how y'all do with that next Sunday. Do y'all think we have each other's passwords? What y'all think? Let's see. Do I go through her phone? Does yeah. she go through my phone? I wish he would, boo boo. Anywho, we'll talk about that <laughs> next next week. So we hope you guys enjoyed it. We hope y'all got something from it today. Yeah. Uh, on Marriage Monday with the Mitchells. Yep. Y'all have if, the best day. If you got questions, send them to who? This girl at Try My God. Yeah. You guys have a great week. Bye, y'all. Bye. See you later.